Hello everyone, this is Mark with MrHurricaneTracker.webs.com. Today is December 11th, 2011. Current time is 6.04 p.m. and I'm actually introducing you guys to the new radar software that I will be using to track severe weather. I'm going to show you that in just a moment because there is some severe weather that I'd like to show you that we'll be tracking and it's not uh, affecting anybody as of yet. But first of all, taking a look in my hometown, this was uh, yesterday and the day before yesterday, we had some showers that started to cause trouble with travel and these showers started off here in the south and moved on up into San Antonio and of course right now Jordanton is experiencing some light showers which are pretty much diminishing and going away and including the Broncos. What I like about this radar is it's live, it gets live updates and it gets live watches and warnings before the warnings get posted out into the public. So this radar I will be using to definitely post updates and track severe weather with you guys if I am available to do the video. And if I'm not, then I'll be updating it later on. Now, let's take a look at Jacksonville, Florida, or the area of Florida. We're showing some showers and thunderstorms off the coast. And I will put this in a loop pattern so we can take a look. And if you see these uh, triangles out here, these are indicators of severe weather. And I'm going to go ahead and pause it now that you've seen the actual loop. If you see this triangle, actually, let me try to pause it real quick. Yeah, if you see this triangle, and the triangle actually is a full shaped triangle and you got these open shaped triangles which means the storm is not quite severe yet or has not reached its severe potential once it reaches its severe potential and this triangle actually gets full if you're on land or if this is on land and if it is a severe storm the warning software on this program will alert me and let me know where the actual warning is going to be I'm going to bring that in real quick this is the warnings tab which is open all the time on the computer and will actually indicate where the warning is where it's actually going to hit, what time it's going to hit before it hits so if there's any severe weather I will try to track it with you guys right here at Mr. Hurricane Tracker and it's going to be something new I'll be trying to do on Mr. Hurricane Tracker for new updates uh, now this is actually right here I'm going to bring this in because this is what we call a storm attribute list if you're taking a look at the triangle that I showed you here which indicates the cell or storm system that is gradually increasing into a severe storm system this is cell R8 and is indicated up here cell R8 and is moving in a southerly direction which is going to have no effect and may not even move into Florida depending on the wind speed and where the winds are blowing once it moves in that southerly direction but if you push play you see in some cases it may have moved south and it may have moved again in a different direction and as you see some of these storms are actually moving into Florida so we might have to watch this and another area that I like to actually look at real quick is Georgia where they're getting some showers and thunderstorms uh, very very light showers it's not something you have to really worry about it looks like but once again guys I just wanted to show you this radar because it's got some good images and views so you take a look at the states and or the cities you can see the storms as they pass right on through the cities and again we'll continue to keep you posted if any updates come about with severe weather anywhere in the United States I will post it right here using this brand new program that I just got so once again thank you very much for watching guys please rate subscribe and comment and have a wonderful day